Title. Shadows Between Us. Ever since Jenna found the old locket in her grandmother's attic, she felt an unshakable pull towards it. The moment she'd clasped it in her palm, time seemed to shuffle, memories merging as if the world around her were a half-forgotten dream. The intricate gold design shimmered with haunting beauty, yet something about it felt wrong, like a whisper echoing just beyond her comprehension. Curiosity led her to twist the locket open, revealing a faded photograph of a girl who looked just like her but with a darker aura. As Jenna turned the locket over, a single word etched into the gold caught her eye. Verity. Quote, that night, Jenna dreamt vividly of a parallel world, where shadows slithered like living things, and the skies burned with hues of orange and violet, tinted by lingering twilight. She found herself in an endless maze of twisted trees, their gnarled branches reaching down like fingers grasping for her. Every corner she turned led her deeper into the darkness, where long-forgotten memories merged into new horrors. In this realm, Jenna encountered Verity, her dark doppelganger. The girl had haunting emerald eyes, glimmering with mischief, and a smile that chilled Jenna to her core. Welcome, Verity said, her voice a silken whisper that danced around Jenna like the wind. I've been waiting for you. Quote, who are you? Jenna stammered, backing away as dread pooled in her stomach. I'm you. Just a shadow of who you could be. Verity's laughter echoed through the trees, a sound so bright it scraped against Jenna's ears. You see, every choice you make shapes our realities. But sometimes, sometimes you have to let the darkness in. Quote, the forest shivered as if aware of their conversations, branches groaning and entwining tighter. Jenna felt a tug at her heart, an urge to understand this twisted alternate life where she was tempted by darker paths. The next morning, Jenna awoke in her own bed, drenched in sweat. She shook off the remnants of her dream but found the locket still tight in her grasp. She felt new desires sparking nonchalantly, nudging her decisions toward recklessness. She started to do things she'd never imagined, skipping school, lying to her friends, indulging in dark thoughts. Each instance nudged her closer to Verity's world, and the consequences grew heavier, looming like storm clouds over her head. When she looked in the mirror, shadows danced behind her, flickering out of sight before she could catch a full glimpse. It whispered to her, filling her head with the dark thrill of freedom. Days blurred into weeks as the lines between her realities began to fade. The idea of confronting Verity twisted around her thoughts, tempting her to seek answers like a moth to a flame. One night, with the moon high and heavy in the sky, she slipped the locket around her neck, and whispered a name just loud enough to carry. Verity. Quote, Immediately, the world shifted. Jenna fell through the swirling ether, tumbling into the foreboding shadows of the forest once more. The atmosphere crackled with energy as the twisted trees closed in around her. She found Verity at the center, skin shimmering and eyes blazing like beacons. You've come to play. Verity exclaimed with a smile that sent a shiver down Jenna's spine. But the game has changed. I gave you a taste of what you could be, and now you'll join me, or maybe, I'll consume you. Quote, before Jenna could react, the shadows reached out, grasping at her ankles like desperate hands. Panic surged through her as memories flashed in her mind. The warmth of her friend's laughter, the simple joys of school, the love that had once paved her life. She realized that darkness was enticing, but it was not the path she wanted. No, Jenna shouted, her voice ringing like a bell through the haunting silence. I choose my own reality. In that moment of defiance, the shadows recoiled, dissipating like mist under sunlight. Verity's expression twisted into something dark and feral, recognizing the strength that swelled within her own reflection. No, she screeched. You'll pay for this. Before Jenna could escape, a fierce energy enveloped her, tearing through the fabric of both realms, bringing Ruth back fully to her own world. She awoke with a gasp in her familiar surroundings, heart racing, the locket now cold against her skin. For weeks, Jenna struggled with the aftershocks of her encounter. She kept the locket hidden, knowing that within its golden frame lay the possibility of her darkest desires. She focused on the light, friendship, laughter, and the reality she fought tirelessly to build. Gradually, the urge to yield to darkness faded, but sometimes, just sometimes, she felt the cool brush of shadows lurking in the corners, whispering her name. 
She remembered Verity's laughter and found a grim comfort in silence. The shadows between them would remain, a part of her story forever lurking in the depths of unmade choices.